Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis (ALS) is a serious devastating neurodegenerative disorder that leads to the progressive loss of voluntary muscular function of the body. As this disorder typically progresses, the affected individual loses the ability to even breathe as the diaphragm gets paralyzed. Upon accepting an artificial ventilation and with orofacial muscle paralysis, the individual in most cases can no longer speak and even become dependent on assistive and augmentative communication devices. And this may progress into the locked-in state with intact eye movement or even a gaze control. Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and today I am going to talk to all of you about how technology has advanced in the field of medicine and how this has been shown as an ability to make a fully paralyzed patient talk. Those studies have evaluated that communication in people with a remaining muscle control, it is not known whether a neural based communication remains possible in a completely locked in state. This was a first study to evaluate this paradigm wherein the study published in the Nature Communications Journal. Here the researchers implanted two microelectrode arrays in a supplementary and the primary motor cortex of a patient in a completely locked in state suffering with amyotropic lateral sclerosis. The patient modulated the neural firing rates based on auditory feedback and this strategy was used to select letters one at a time to form words and phrases to communicate his needs and even experiences. This case study being unique provides evidence that brain-based volitional communication is possible even in a completely locked in state. We can say that this case has definitely demonstrated that a patient without any stable and reliable means of eye movement control or an identifiable communication route employed a neurofeedback strategy to modulate the firing rates of neuron in a paradigm allowing him to actually select letters to form words and even sentences to express his desires and experiences. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for further updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.